The VQ OrthoCare OActive 2 Osteoarthritis or OA brace is a single hinge brace worn on the lateral or outside of the left or right leg and is universally sized. In the brace bag, you will find the OActive 2 brace and a plastic accessories bag. In the plastic bag is the instructions for use, the warranty card, the flexion and extension stops, the patient adjustment tool, extra condyle pad, an elastic strap extender, and the suspension wrap. The patient adjustment tool is used in the Q hinge to provide correction in the brace. The condyle pad is a thinner one than the one in the brace and may be used for comfort if needed. The warranty card tells you who to call for service of the brace and the instructions for use will be covered in this video. The flexion and extension stops may be used to limit your movement in the brace, but should only be used if prescribed by your physician. The elastic strap extender may be used if either of the top straps are not staying in place. The extender allows the straps to move with soft tissue, but keep the strap secured. The suspension wrap is used to help secure the brace to the leg and is attached to the brace using Velcro. Other accessories available are cotton lycra undersleeves and oversleeves and neoprene undersleeves and oversleeves. Prior to application, open the brace by lifting up on the buckles and unhooking the buckles from the frame. Loosen the straps by peeling up the strap tab and reapplying at the end of the strap. While sitting at the edge of a chair, bend your knees slightly and apply the brace to the lateral or outside of the leg. Align the center of the hinge with the top of the kneecap and position slightly behind midline of the leg. On the initial fitting for the OActive 2 off-the-shelf brace, the brace should first be adjusted to neutral. This is achieved by setting the correction angle at the Q-hinge so the cuffs and hinge rest on the leg without gapping or pressure. Medial or lateral compartment correction will be adjusted later. If you have a custom OActive 2 brace, the correction is preset and should not be set to neutral. Next, attach the strap buckles in the sequence indicated on the strap ends by hooking the buckle on the frame and snapping the buckle down. Be sure to securely snap the buckle into place. Hold the brace to prevent rotation while tightening straps. All straps should be comfortably tightened to properly secure the brace and provide relief. Do not over tighten the thigh straps. Once the straps are secure, check to make sure the center of the hinge is still aligned with the top of the kneecap and positioned slightly behind the midline of the leg. To ensure it is properly fit for activity, walk a short distance. It is normal for the brace to drop or settle into position slightly. Make strap and position adjustments as necessary. The straps are now set for proper fit and do not need to be loosened and tightened for each application. The brace can now be put on and taken off using just the set fit buckles.
With the patient seated, bend the knee to 90 degrees. Next, using the patient adjustment tool provided, turn the Q-hinge screw a quarter turn clockwise to increase lateral compartment relief or one quarter turn counterclockwise to increase medial compartment relief. This is a good starting point for initial use. Stand and have the patient walk a short distance to ensure comfort and proper correction after each adjustment. If there is any discomfort in the knee joint or leg, turn the angle adjustment back slightly. The patient should only feel a gentle and slight pressure on the knee. If more relief is required, turn the Q-hinge screw no more than an additional eighth of a turn. Walk after the adjustment and check again. Over adjusting the Q-hinge may cause discomfort, rotation, or skin pressure issues. Always adjust conservatively. Gradually increase brace wear time to allow your body to adjust to the brace. Start with 30 minutes on the first day and gradually increase. Pain caused by osteoarthritis may take time to subside. It is important that you routinely wear the brace during weight-bearing activities, for example when you're on your feet, as it will reduce joint loading and allow you to begin feeling relief. It may take a number of weeks for relief to become significant. Salt water, sand, dirt, and other elements can cause damage. Thoroughly rinse the brace with fresh water after exposure to these conditions. Towel or air dry. Liners should be removed and hand wash as needed using cold water and mild detergent. Rinse thoroughly and air dry. Do not machine dry. Lubricate the hinges with dry silicone spray as needed. Attach the Velcroed straight edge of the suspension wrap to the inside two straps of the lower half of the brace. Pull the wrap around the outside of the leg and continue to wrap, attaching it to itself by pressing down the finger pulls at the end. The wrap should be positioned so that the top edge is a half inch above the strap right below the knee, but it should not bunch in the back of the knee. The wrap should be removed and hand washed as needed using cold water and mild detergent. Rinse thoroughly and air dry. Do not machine dry. 